Hi, I'm Chris Carey, the TV broadcaster for the Oakland A's, and you're watching Bay Area Sports Wrap. Uh, what do you think of uh, JP's outing today? Yeah, you know, I thought I thought JP did good. Um, you know, coming in this outing, <clears throat> you know, these young guys are going on four days rest, five days rest. I mean, he did it last year, but uh, beginning of the year, so for him to go out and give us five and and get through that, you know, lineup, uh, I thought he did a nice job. Just you know, handling handling the situation. Um, he didn't have his best command, obviously, with the three walks, but managed to give us five and and uh, come out with a lead. Um, just at eight, you mentioned there, but just at 82 pitches after five, you felt like that was um, just given the workload better to just take him out there. Yeah, I mean, last outing in Texas, you know, I think he threw 88 maybe somewhere in or around there. Uh, the recovery this week probably wasn't as great as it's been. Um, and uh, you know, again, for him to go out and, and, you know, give us that start, I thought it was, it was you know, the right exit point for him. Um, and uh, the way our bullpen's been throwing the baseball, I had all, all the confidence in the world, and, and you know that bullpen, our bullpen, the way they've been throwing. Um, Kyle McCann, a couple of hits, including his first homer, and then throws a guy out. Uh, what do you think of just his overall day? Yeah, great day for Kyle. You know, it's, as a backup catcher, you know you're playing once every five, six days. Um, you know he does everything he can to stay prepared, stay ready, and uh, you know he caught JP last week in Texas. So um, you know another great, great job by him, really handling JP. And uh, and offensively, you know, um, to see him homer, we know he's got that type of pop. Um, you know, it was a, it was a good day for for Kyle. With JP um, between starts was it a little more tight than usual? Not not as much. It's just recovery, John. Recovery. You know, I mean, these guys. He's a small guy. He's going out there. Um, you know, and uh, you know, it's a long year. It's the beginning of the year. It's his fourth start. So. Um, you know, rather than push him through a sixth inning where if there's a base runner, I'm probably going to go get him regardless. Um, you know, it's the right exit point for me and, and for him in our discussion. That first sack fly in the sixth um, fly ball to Blade, should he have thrown to third and should the first baseman have been in the middle of the diamond? Yeah, that, that ball, I mean, we've talked to JJ. That ball is too deep to throw it to home play for any reason. Um, you know, that, that to keep the backside runner at second base, and you got a routine fly ball to center, and we're most likely out of that inning. So, you know, defense and, and the two walks by Danny obviously led to us being in that situation. So walks and, and a defensive play that um, we should be able to make uh, really cost us a game. And and um, the first baseman needn't... Th the first baseman does not to, go to, to, that, to that position. Okay. We're not cutting that ball from left center gap to go home for the first baseman. So he's not out of position, no. I just want to ask real quickly about uh, Lance Lynn. Looked like he, you know, even for his age, he just pitched like a, a veteran. Yeah, I mean, he's been doing it for years. Um, you know, he'll give up a home run here and there. Uh, he has the ability to strike guys out. I think he had 200 strikeouts last year. Uh, you know, he's a veteran guy that, that uh, he's durable. I mean, he's shown that throughout his career. And uh, we had some opportunities. We couldn't get the two out hit at times tonight. Uh, we couldn't add on to our lead, really. And uh, uh, that's pretty much the story of the game. Seth Brown had some pretty decent at bats tonight. What did you like about his approach at the plate? Well, I mean, he cued a ball down the left field line that uh, that was a double. So, um, you know, but the line drive to center really looked good. Um, you know, he squared that baseball up on a fastball, uh, which is a good sign. Right. Hey, fans, I'm Kara Suboy with Bay Area Sports Wrap. Don't forget to give us a like and subscribe to our YouTube channel.